hi guys welcome to design 101 and today i'm going to show you how you can import your models from revit or sketchup to lumion now lumion offers the fastest workflow to achieve photorealism without getting into intricate details of material nodes and lighting it comes with presets that are useful when it comes to saving time now what i need you to do is open your revit model it is actually very easy to create models on revit if you know the basics i'm going to upload another video for that for now in this model this is the section box we don't need it so i'm gonna uncheck the box now that the section box is gone we have the 3d file to export this 3d file there are a few ways you can take so uh, in the earlier versions we had to export the file but now there's an option called lumion life sync that you can use or you can export a colada file that contains all the details like uh, the textures and the materials you can export your model in various ways in this case i wanted to change certain things about this model in sketchup so i exported a cad format file So now it's actually really easy to export a CAD file of the 3D model. All you need to do is export a CAD file and save it uh, wherever you need it. Now that we have our CAD file, I'm going to open it up. Now I'm just going to convert it to an older version because all the SketchUp versions support CAD formats before 2010. So if your file isn't importing in SketchUp, uh, it is probably because your version is newer. Now we are in SketchUp and all you need to do is import and locate the file. After locating the file you just click on it and open. It will import in a while showing you the details of the model. Now you can see the model doesn't have any materials. That is something we need to do on SketchUp. That's why I brought it here. Now uh, in this particular model I didn't need furniture that I had put in the Revit file so I'm just going to open the file it comes in as a component you can double tap on it and edit the details like I'm going to delete the furniture because furniture is something that you can put in Lumion in much better detail. Now you can assign materials to wherever places you want to change materials in Lumion. Uh, as you can the color doesn't matter and the texture doesn't either because you can just change these colors into whatever textures you need in Lumion. So I'm going to assign materials to all the components that I want to change in Lumion. After all that and the changes I needed to do on the model, my model looks something like this. Uh, I have introduced some more things that I didn't have on the Revit model like these vines that can be used in Lumion and these water tanks. Some details on the back that weren't there previously and all the materials are what I needed them to be for my Lumion model. Now you can just save the model and open up Lumion. Now in Lumion you need to open a new file. I'm gonna open a plane and then load my model. So here's my new file. Uh, in Lumion all you need to do is place models uh, from your library 
now to bring models into this library what you need to do is click on the import button that is on the left side which is what i am going to do i have already loaded the model actually so this is how you just place it Now to bring stuff into this library what you need to do is go to import then locate your file your sketch of file with the color assigned open it up and you are ready to go after making certain changes and adding details to the model now my model looks something like this i added all this furniture and changed all the materials which is going to be another video So this is how you import your models from Revit or SketchUp to Lumion. Now just for a recap, you go to import, locate your file, open up the 3D model and you are ready to go. You can just place it wherever you want it. So that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching and hit the subscribe button press the bell icon to get notified whenever i upload a video